no, it's just exciting, exciting times. Just looking forward to get going now and, and meeting the guys. It has been a whirlwind few months for you, has it not? Yeah, absolutely. You know, um, especially after last season, getting promotion with, with Wolves, then, you know, to top that and have the buff for my boy Caden, um, it's been non-stop. So now this is just another another step and we, we look to get going. Can you talk us through the, the timeline, really, of, of becoming a Leeds player? Where did you know about the interest? How has it kind of come about? Um, it's came quite, quite fast, to be honest. Um, Wolves obviously took the decision to to let me know that I wasn't going to be part of the, the plans, which was a bit um, hard to take at first, but, you know, life goes on. Um, and then I found out about the interest from Leeds and just the, the project here is, is similar to what was going on last year at, at Wolves. It's very exciting, so that's what made the decision for me to come here. Yeah, the manager here, the head coach, Marcelo Bielsa, was that a big part of your decision? Yeah, and you know, I think the way that the, the manager's speaking of, of playing is going to suit me down at a so hopefully we can complement each other and, and have success. Yeah, I mean, you had, I'm no doubt, probably other options for you, but, you know, Leeds United, huge club, huge expectation as well. Is that an attraction too? Yeah, um, absolutely. It's a, a massive club, you know, and, and I'm sure the fans want it to be back in, in the top flight where it rightfully belongs so hopefully I can bring some success to the club as well as, as enjoying the journey. Well the fans are excited about you signing Barry because all those assists, all those free kicks including one against us last year. <laughs> yeah, I'm sure the um, fans weren't happy at me last year but hopefully I can replicate that this season and, and get involved in the goals and assists. Got a code, it'll be a strike on goal, yeah. it's the back of the net. Wolves take the lead, it's an absolutely wonderful finish into the top right corner. It gives Andy Lonergan no chance. That is pinpoint precision. You, you, you know, you, you've still got many, many years left of your career, but how much experience are you going to bring to the dressing room after what you achieved last season? Because it was a quite remarkable season for you, wasn't it? Yeah, it was a great journey, you know, and I think also my time abroad, it will be be easier to probably adapt to, to the new coach and, and his way of playing. Um, so, yeah, no, I, I'll just try and help out as much as I can, but... Ultimately, the boys will, will get on well and, and teach me about the place. Yeah, I mean, you, you follow a long tradition as well of Scottish players here as well. Is that something you're aware of? Yeah, I've been made aware of it, so yeah. there's uh, no pressure. <laughs> I've been told all the Scotsmen have, have left their legacy here, yeah. so, yeah, hopefully I can I can have the same effect. Yeah, And how quick can you kind of settle in then? Because it's a, a week until the season starts against Stokes. How quickly can you can you settle in and be ready? Yeah, now that, you know, the business side of it's at the road, I'm... Tomorrow I'll go and get organised, um, go and get my things and um, say goodbye to to my friends, colleagues at, at Wolves and then ultimately it'll probably be be Monday, I'm, I'm back in and hopefully get going. Yeah, and you know the big kick-off here, it's a lot of excitement, isn't it? The Championship's going to be as competitive as ever, isn't it? Yeah, you know, there's some massive clubs, um, the same as last year, it's, it's going to be a, a, tough, a tough opening, but... You know, Leeds are, are a big club with big ambitions and I'm sure we'll do well. Back to back promotions, that'd be be pretty nice for you, wouldn't it? Would be nice, that's the plan, you know, that's mm. the ambition. So hopefully we can achieve that.